All right, guys. Yeah, similarities to a couple of weeks ago. We were, um, we don't like losing, um, but I can accept it when there's a performance like that. I can see the players are committed, gave absolutely everything. Uh, we just came up a little bit short in uh, in key moments in both boxes, but when the fans are clapping us off like that at the end of the game, I'm, you know, I'm extremely proud to represent this football club um, and work with these players because they gave absolutely everything. And we were in the game, you know, everyone could see that, no one could disagree with it. We knew Chelsea are going to be able to create, they've got top players, they created at times, but we were very resilient and actually I thought we were incredibly brave. I thought our back line was high, we were aggressive, we went man for man at times, we tried to press them, we tried to take the ball, which we did. Um, I thought for a 15 minute spell in the second half, we had the territory, we weren't necessarily creating loads of chances, we had the territory. The game started getting a little bit transitional. And I was just hoping it was going to be us that got a goal. I could smell a goal coming, but it was it was them, unfortunately. So, um, you know, I, I, disappointment, of course. But um, I've seen improvement in the two weeks since Brighton, the 13 days, and uh, I, I know we'll see improvement again in a week's time. He's a top player. I mean, he was amazing on the. Um, wherever it was against West Ham, I was there, I was at the game and yeah, he was very, very good tonight again, which we expected. Um, so yeah, that's just what he is, he's a top, top Premier League player and a top international footballer and this is the level that we're at now, so it's no surprise we're going to be facing that sort of thing every week. Yeah, we had the territory. Um, so we're in the game, half time, all right, we're one and down, but we're in the game. And I thought the second half we started very, very well. And um, moments, moments to cross, just like that little bit of quality, that bit of finesse, didn't pick someone out. Ryan Giles obviously had a good opportunity that was just half blocked and probably our cleanest one. Um, and then the game was going a little bit more end to end, getting a bit stretched. And uh, clearly then they become very dangerous as well. Because we're in the game, you can't change too much. You've got to hope then that we can see any dangerous moments out. We, you know, that second goal um, probably deflate us a little bit. We've got to make sure we learn now as that third one doesn't come because even at two 0 then you're still in the game. Yeah, it could have done. It was a, it was a, you know, it was a big moment for us. We're not going to get many chances here at Stamford Bridge, but um, that was a really well worked opportunity, and. Uh, yeah, you, know, you know they 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 really they defended it well because they got the block. Pleased, really pleased. Uh, Berkey again. We've got to you know got to make sure we're managing him is is low because it was his first his first um, competitive game for a long time. And Ross really pleased him. As I said, the, the couple of weeks since he's been in, he's made a real impact in training. Been a great influence on the group, and I thought his performance was was good tonight. And I know there's a lot more to come from him as well, so that's a big plus for us. Yeah, very special. Some, you know, they're so proud of their their team, their club. Been through a really difficult, long period of time, as we all know, and the journey is great. So they're going to enjoy this moment. I want them to enjoy the moment. They'll enjoy it when we get points more. But when they're clapping us like that and they can see how hard we've worked and the effort that we've given and how much we competed, you know, then that's uh, that is all they can ask as well. We can never guarantee we're going to win. We guarantee we're going to give everything and the lads left it all out there.